Welcome to Electron Online. Here we're going to show you how to convert numbers in decimal format to numbers in scientific notation. What you need to realize is that this is going to look something like this. You rewrite the number, but now you place the decimal right behind the first number. So this is going to be written as 2.846 times 10 to some exponent. So the whole idea is, what is that exponent? And it all depends upon how many times or how many places you have to move the decimal point. So in this case, we need to move the decimal point from here, two spots, which means we're going to put the number 2 there. So it's 2.846 times 10 to the second. On the next one, you want to write this number as 2.45 times 10 to the, and since we moved it to the right, there's going to be a negative sign in front because we moved the decimal place to the right. Now we need to figure out how many spots. So in this case, it's one, two spots. So therefore, we need the number two there, but it's going to be negative two because we moved to the right. It's a positive number when we move to the left. On the next one, this is going to be written as 3.125 times 10 to some exponent. Again, that exponent will depend upon how many times we move the decimal spot. In this case, we move to the left. Even though we don't write it, it's right over here. So we move it one, two, three, four, five, six spots. Six spots means we need the number six there. So it's 3.125 times 10 to the sixth. Let's try this one right here. Now, since there's a negative sign in, in front there, well, actually, it makes no difference at all. We simply ignore that neg negative sign. This will be equal to minus 4.2. Again, all that matters where we put the decimal point. And this will be times 10 to some exponent. Now, did we move to the right or did we move to the left? Well, in this case, we had to move to the right. One, two, three spots. That means I need a minus 3 over there. And the next one. Here we have to move one, two, three, four spots. So this is going to be written as 5.6 times 10 to some exponent. And again, if we count it carefully, here we have one, two, three, four spots. So this becomes a minus four because we have to move to the right. On the next one, this is going to be written as 2.45 times 10 to some exponent. And here, even though we don't write the decimal place, it's right there. We have to move one, two, three, four, five spots. So we write the number five there. And finally, here, this is going to be written as 2.4006 times 10 to some exponent. And here we have to take the decimal place and move it one, two spots to the left. So therefore, we need the number two there. And that is how we convert from decimal format to scientific notation format. You see, it's really not that hard. All we have to do is realize when we move to the left, we write a positive exponent. When we move to the right, we write a negative exponent. And the number of decimal place movements, the number of digits we move the decimal place, that's the number that goes on top. And that's how we convert from decimal to scientific notation.